everyone! So we're shooting for Neymar today and we're gonna dye my she hair. She has taken over! <laughs> and this is Neymar and we're shooting another video today. She's gonna be my lab rat for today, basically. Sadly. <laughs> it's a hair related video. <laughs> okay, so hair, her hair so is virgin hair. She has she has never colored it and her hair is very ash ash brownish. Yeah. So on the cool tones of brown. So it's not a very warm brown. So I was thinking that maybe we can dye her hair. So we hair. got yeah. <laughs> so we've got a hair dye and I've always I have personal experience with hair dye, especially dyeing it at home or getting it done from the potter as well. But I've never, um, she's never done it and I've done it on people as well. Yeah. So the hair dye we're using today is the L'Oreal Paris. Yeah, this is Casting Creme Gloss, um, the one without ammonia. Now they have a bunch of sh uh, range. Uh, this is the one that has less ammonia, that's for virgin hair. So what this basically does is it, ju it's, it just stays on the top layer of your hair. So it's a temporary dye, it's not a permanent, permanent dye. One. It doesn't damage your hair. Yeah, it doesn't damage your hair and basically it's not going to um, really strip your hair down. You know how when you get your hair dyed, they have to first strip it down, that they, they don't bleach it. Oh. Then they apply color on top. That's how the color comes. So basically, this is uh, free of that, and it's gonna be, it's gonna take care of your hair as well. It's gonna uh, maintain the texture of your hair. So when I used to, buy, I got it done 2012 in Nixer time. Oh. In 2012, I used this, but I used a mahogany shade. So it was, I had black hair, like jet black hair. So I dyed it a mahogany -ish shade, mm -hmm. and it was visible under the sun only. Oh yeah, just I say, remember that. Yeah, yeah, just say inside the room, it was fine. Like it, it there was but a slight difference in the sunlight. But when I stepped out in the sun, it was yeah. like fire on my head. So this is casting cream gloss, and this is in the shade five three five chocolate. I'll put in a close up, uh, and I'll add the details where you can get it from here. And okay, so let's open Anything it else? first. Yeah. And she comes yeah. the first time. Like, oh, wow. <laughs> this is interesting. So there's a leaflet with instructions. And we have one, two, three, four. We have four products inside, basically. Right? So pretty easy. Yes. So we have the casting cream gloss. This is the ammonia free cream color. Basically, this is the one that holds the dye. This is the conditioner. This is to maintain um, the uh, silkiness and the softness of your hair. And this is the something else. <laughs> We're, gonna find with the We're gonna basically add everything yeah. in this and then apply it with this here and these are gloves, safety gloves for your hands so they don't stain your hands. They've listed the products that are inside the box they, and they have two options of the way you can apply. One for virgin hair and one for if you already have colored hair. So you can go about both ways. We're gonna go with the virgin hair one. So basically these are the only two items that you'll be using to dye your hair. And this is the post treatment. So once you've already dyed your hair, I think you have to wash it with this. Yeah, you have to wash it with that. So I. This seems is the, pretty easy though. Yeah, seems pretty easy. Mm. And basically, this is at home uh, DIY kind of a thing. So you guys can do it and Just get it uh, yourself, and then uh, dye your hair yourself. Yep. It's for convenience. It's for on the go kind of a thing. So this is her before hair shot, and now you'll see the after. So stay tuned for that. Now is we're mixing the cream color, the tube that contains the color, and we're gonna squeeze it all out in this bottle, which is the developer. So we're gonna make sure that everything is in there. We need to empty out the entire tube, and then we're gonna close the developer tube and then just shake it really well before applying. I have my gloves on that were in the box provided, and I'm just sectioning her hair into two halves, and then I'm gonna work uh, in small portions. So what I'm doing is I'm applying the color on the length and the tip of the hair. So I'm focusing more on the length of the hair first and then I'm going to go on to the roots. So I just, just so I uh, get a slight idea of how much product is available on this and how much is going to be used on her uh, entire head. So uh, I'm doing this on the, the other side now. So again, I'm focusing it on the length and I'm going to slowly massage it into the length and tip of her hair. Now with whatever product I have left, I'm some on my hand and I'm focusing uh, the product on the roots and just massaging it onto her scalp just so I don't miss the roots. And then whatever, I still had some product la left so I just squeeze it all out in her on her hair and I just massaged uh, it all together. 
I'm just tying her hair uh, in a bun and securing it on a side. So I have applied the color to her hair. Now we're gonna leave it for about 25, 20 minutes. Basically, the longer you leave it on, the better the color is gonna show. So it says 20 minutes on the box. So we're gonna try 25. All right. Because she's the boss. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and yeah, and then we'll wash it off and then we'll show you and we're gonna condition it with this. We'll show the close up later. We will be back after 20, 25 minutes. 